All right, I'm gonna show you guys a Komodo edit um, right here. Komodo edit. I'll put the link in the description. But it's a cross-platform open source code editor for Windows, Mac, and Linux. And sometimes you don't want a full IDE. A lot of times when I'm just writing Python or PHP, I just want a text editor. So uh, here's what it looks like. It's got syntax for almost every major language. If you hit other, there's even all of these. And it just has so much. And one of the really cool things about it is it has Vim key bindings. So I'm using H, J, K, and L to move around my document. It's in uh, command mode. If we hit I, it goes into insert mode. Uh, it has many of the same key bindings that Vim has. Oh, let me see this. Uh, you can see them all here. There's a ton of them. So uh, my GG goes to the start of the file. Um, you can hit dollar sign A to insert after. And then uh, write your line, hit escape. Uh, go back to insert mode and then VD deletes the line so that's really nice if you go in a Komodo edits preferences it almost looks like Eclipse it has so much stuff but um, key bindings there's Emacs, Vim or default Windows I don't know what that is um, but you can really customize this however you want and it works very well uh, another thing you can do is split the pane, so a VSP, the first time it gives you a horizontal split, the second time vertical split, so you have two panes here. Uh, if you can see up at the top, uh, my file is unsaved, so if I hit colon W just like in Vim, it will write the file. So. Uh, that's really nice and it has this syntax for everything even um, action script, MXML, uh, PHP and code folding for you and there's Python again so uh, even has Java and I've opened up Objective-C in it but um, you have to use Smalltalk because it doesn't have an Objective-C um, syntax file so check it out it's free um, I really like it it replaced a lot my other text editor that I was using and uh, it even has some code completion for you so in this Java file here to the left if I start typing the buf and then control space adds it in for me rd and then see it even put in that bracket another bracket so it's pretty smart for just a text editor uh, let me delete that All right. so yeah go check it out it's really good